follow me as we journey to the hill and also the environment of Adu Hawaii. Can I touch the lake? Redeeming the image of Africa all over the world. Hello, my wonderful people. A beautiful day to you wherever you are in the world. I remain your G. Arenga. Yeah, um, <laughs> please subscribe. <laughs> if you are watching for the first time, yes, please, you need to subscribe. Encourage me by subscribing to this channel and make sure you turn on the notification bell. Please. Please. <laughs> now let me tell you about my adventure to Ado Hawaii Suspended Lake. Today we are on our way to where we call a small town where we call Ado Hawaii. Ado Hawaii is a very special place, but you know, many people. Are yet to discover the place. However, we have only two suspended lakes in the old world. We have one in uh, Colorado, that's in the United States of America, and the second one is Ado Hawaii here. So I will take you down to Ado Hawaii to see this lake. So, we just well. suspended lake in the whole world. Yeah, uh, you have, we have one in uh, Colorado, USA, and another one in Ado Hawaii. Ado Hawaii is in Oyo State. Yes. So I decided with my team to visit Ado Hawaii. Though the road to Ado Hawaii, you know, it's very bad. The road, like I said, from Oyo, because we are coming from Oyo, and we spent almost two hours, if not more than two hours, in getting to this place. And um, from Oyo to Ishenyen, the road, no, 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 just too terrible, honestly. The road is very bad, and it's part of what we are trying to, you know, uh, uh, the part of the message we are trying to pass to the government. If something is unique and in the whole world you have just two and you have one in your country, I believe the, the government should cherish that and invest in that uh, project. To me, that is what I feel, but the road to that place is very bad. I met a young man here and he was telling me some certain story. So let me go to him and ask him, you know, what he has to say. But, uh, we saw a, a vulcanizer, so there we asked him, where do we have the Adu Hawaii suspended lake? Ah, and the guy said, ah, it's very close to where the was. I met uh, one of the indigenous, I have some of them here. He said, okay, okay, okay. But uh, 
you know. But it's a penny, I draw away. Over 20 years. Over 20 years. Kilo Rukoiza. Idowu. Idowu. That's Mr. Idowu for you. So, Mr. Idowu, you know, 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 you I just want to ask, but we will definitely, someone will take us to the King's Palace, from the King's Palace, then we proceed on the mountain. Let's see if we'll be able to succeed in climbing to the top today. Yes. So, however, I just want uh, Mr. Ido to tell us some certain things. Like, I was hearing some news, but before I get the full whatever, so I want to hear from him, sir. And so, I'm going to sir. Any... And so, I want to go back on B. I want you 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 to go to go back on can you hear what uh, Baba is saying? He was just telling me that when you get to a certain place uh, before climbing the... Is it? Okay, at the top of the mountain. So he said, there was this Baba, you know, an elderly man. You know, the man, you know, was based there. And, uh, you know, the whites, they came in here, the Western people, they came in here to, you know, visit the mountain and they saw Baba. Somehow, they, I, I don't want to, because I, I'm not sure, but from what the indigenous are saying now is that Baba was being taken away from the mountain. So ever since the Western uh, uh, people that came to visit the mountain left, ever since then, Baba has not yet been found. That's mystery, or what will you call it? That's mystery to me. And he said he will uh, ask uh, his apprentice, one of his boys, to come and uh, take us to the place. However, he said, it better if we can visit the king. And uh, the king can also get someone that uh, appoint someone that will take us to the, to the lake. So, luckily for us, an elderly man also joined and volunteered to take us to the king's palace. So we got when we got to the king's palace, the king were welcomed, and the, the king <laughs> told us a lot. That is going to be another video entirely. That's the history of Ado Hawaii suspended lake. So, About one or two things that the king you know, had to tell us about this town. Adwawa is an historic town. Once a son of a laugh, he's an laugh anywhere. I am His Royal Majesty. Our Reverend Ademola Olubili for coming. There was another small settlement called Hawaii. You, as a prince of Alafi, we will make you our king. That's how the word Ado came into. So it's a taboo. You don't enter into that lake. So that's that. So from there, the king appointed someone to take us to the lake. This is what the Ado Hawaii's uh, king's uh, palace looked like. That's where we are. So we just finished interviewing the the king himself so now the king wants one of his uh, officers to take us to the mountain when we got to the bottom of the hill mountain ah we are here now at the entrance of Adoawaye mountain look at it So, we do have uh, 
some villagers here. Apart from the, the staff from the palace that also want to go with us. So, like I said, I have um, a daddy from the king's palace. Your name, sir? Amdaweye. Amdaweye. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so that's the uh, officer that uh, the king handed us over to. So, I have here with me uh, Honku. He's also. Sir, your name? With Mr. Moses Jato. Mr. Moses Jato. So, he's going to be with us to the mountain. And I have a daddy here, too. Your name, sir? Yekinia Ku. So you are an indigenous of this place. Oh, okay. So let's go and explore. <laughs> I don't know what to say. You've heard everything from the king. Let's keep moving. Well, we started climbing. It wasn't easy, but very interesting. We are now climbing the stairs to the mountain. Ha! Yes, sir. So I have my people here with me. I've already introduced them to you. So, from what I heard, it's going to take us nothing less than an hour. That's if we are fit enough. <laughs> Ah. Yeah. Ah, okay, sir, we should come and uh, relax on that shed. <sighs> Going up is difficult. By coming down, I know that will be very easy. So, that's J Boy that we were waiting for. He just uh, stopped uh, flying the drone, so we are here now. And here, we are at the point of uh, a very big rock, and they call this rock Easter Gate. So from the story I heard from our tour guide, this Easter Gate uh, is like a fruitful uh, rock. Whosoever is barren, any woman that is barren, you know, they come when once they come to this place, they pray and seek for, you know, child. And uh, from what I heard, that this rock, more or less like a shrine, you can see the white uh, cloth that is being tied around it. You know, the rock as in Ishage will definitely give that person. A child. So we are still on our way and we learn that hunters are here. They are hunters, Abby. Yeah. I learned these are the hunters. Are you an hunter? Yes. And you? What and you too? Wow. Have you seen young hunters before? Have you seen young hunters before? Yes. These are young hunters. So well done. Uh, what type of animals have you killed before? 
Where are we letting Pari? Eh, Pari. Eh, more than that, Pari. Eh, we're not going. I do pa akiti. Hmm. Akiti. Ewuro. rabbit. Rabbit. Oh yeah. Oh, and bushmeat. Different kind of bushmeat. So they are young boys, and they you can see they are gone. Let me see. Let me see. You have a cutlass, and this one. Let's see the gun. Wow, these are real hunters, oh. These are real hunters. Oh, wow. Well done, Ekushe. And I was so anxious, curious to get to the lake. until we get to the lake itself. Ha! You need to see how I feel. My people, we are now at the suspended lake. We just got in there now. Follow me and let's see the world famous and the one and only suspended lake, natural in the world. Follow me, let's go. This is the famous suspended lake. The only one that we have in the whole world. This is the suspended lake. Wow. Okay. Can I touch the lake? I asked if I can touch the lake. He now said that I should make sure that my leg does not even touch it. If my leg touch it, and my if my leg does not touch it and my hand touch it, my body has already touched it. So it's better for me to just maintain my peace. So if you go on any tour to any places like this, you have to be very careful because you never can tell. And from what we had, some uh, 
guys from the Europe or America, I learned they came here and that they were told that this thing is very, very deep. But they said they just want to know exactly what is there. About 40 something years ago, isn't it? 40 something years ago. So, and when they got here, they tried to have a chain tied to one of the rocks and one of them was going in, in, in and in and in and the guy never came back. So, I know it's part of a adventure. So wherever you are, anywhere you go to, you just have to keep yourself safe as well. So that's just my own advice for any of us doing this kind of a thing that I'm doing. We need to be very careful. Thank you. So this is the lake. We move around. And uh, we saw the lake. You know, we were told that uh, you can that the lake is drinkable, but don't put your foot there, and uh, you can use your bed. I decided not to touch it. Because since they said if you not put your foot there, I don't know, whatever. So it's better you listen and uh, follow what the tour guide, you know, tells you wherever you go to. That's my advice to any of you that go, you know, on this kind of uh, adventure. Remember when the king was addressing us about the elephant? Here is the elephant that the king was talking about. That is it. This is the elephant three. Elephant three. Elephant three in Addu Awaye Hill Mountain. That is it. Ah. I hope I hope the elephant will not come out alive. <laughs> wow. Look at the view, just look at the view here. Look at the view so that you know that yes, we are on top of the so tired so my team they went to bring to you some of the places that uh, the king mentioned in his interview so that those places you will see in this video So, my people, this place is a place where the Ifa priest lived before he was being killed by the white people. This is his um, abode. This is where he lives before he was being killed by the white people.
very, very, very uh, interesting and it is a lifetime adventure that will forever live with me for the rest of my life. This boy to carry this uh, cooler with uh, minerals up to this place. Even we that we're not even uh, carrying anything, we felt it. So the boy fell down and uh, about five bottles got broken. When he got here, he started crying. I have a boy here. He's, his name is, what's your name? Kola Wale Samson. I was just wondering how he managed to climb the stairs from the bottom down to this place. And here he is. He sells a mineral. And the poor boy said he fell down. And about how many bottles got broken? Five. Five bottles. He's even crying. Honestly. It's just a pity. Anyway. So how much, how do you sell it? How much do you sell one bottle? 100 naira. 100 naira. Okay. Don't worry. Everything will be fine, eh? Do you mind if I give you money for the five that got broken? Hmm? Should I give you money for the five? If you give me. You'll be happy. And you won't cry again. Hmm? Okay. So this is the money for the five. So at least, are you okay now? Okay. Oh no 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 no! Oh yeah, smile now. Hmm? Smile now. Something. <laughs> <laughs> Something. Eh? It is well with you, eh? Bele. So that's something for you. Hmm? I know it's not easy. The country is tough. May God help us all. Thank you very much. We just descended from Adrawaye suspended uh, lake uh, mountain hill. <sighs> Honestly, you all need to visit this place. If you made it to the end of this video, that means that you really enjoyed it. So, and if you have not subscribed, this is an opportunity for you to subscribe because I have more interesting video for you so i come your way with another video i say bye bye and uh, then gotcha. however um from what we had said is about one thousand steps but thereafter, when we came back to uh, the Oyo State uh, Tourism Board, so uh, we were told that it's uh, 365 or whatever steps. But whichever way, Adawai Suspended Lake is a lake that every human being needs, needs to visit. visit. Yes. The, the journey, journey was so tough, but it was worth it. it.